Hi everyone, it's me, Lona. And Mike. Yay, look, he knows who he is tonight. It's Monday Night Munchies with Mike, and we are back to you again with another episode in Pecan Month. So, tonight's episode... Oh, you said it was Pecan. No, you said Pecan. No, I'm pretty sure if, if you review the tape last it's week... It's Pecan. <laughs> you can say Pecan all you want. No, okay. it was you that said it. Okay, so, anyways... We have another pecan recipe for you tonight. This one's a little bit different. This may not be something you would traditionally think about, but we are making sweet and spicy Brussels sprouts with pecans. I think when I say pecans, I feel all like posh. Anyways, uh, so we are going to actually make them in the Micro Pro Grill. So the Micro Pro Grill is made of encapsulated steel that can actually go in your microwave and it heats up to 425 degrees in like 90 seconds. So you can actually bake, cook, grill, casserole, sear different foods in like a fraction of the time in your microwave. So what Mike is doing right now, what are you doing right now, Mike? I am chopping the pecans. In what? Product? Are you chopping the pecans? Why do you always gotta ask me the names? It's it's something super sonic chopper compact. I feel like that wasn't that hard for you. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, he's gonna think he's all good now. I think that's all you need to do. Like three little chops. So that. Little Chopper is great for nuts, herbs, like a couple mushrooms, quarter of an onion. Anytime I make an omelet, that's what I use. So what we're actually going to do right now is we're just kind of like, um, what do you actually call that with the pecans? We're just grilling them? Grilling them? Yeah, we're grilling them just a little bit. So you're going to put it in the grill position for two minutes. Then you're gonna mix it and two minutes more. So in the Micro Pro Grill, you're still gonna want to flip things just like you normally would in the frying pan or on the barbecue. So, but you're just doing it in a lot less time. So like a grilled cheese, two minutes, flip two minutes, you're good. You can also do sausages, dips. We've done spinach and artichoke on munchies with Mike. Oh. We had a request. We did? Yeah. Bacon wrapped asparagus. Oh. And asparagus season is coming up. We did that one before. I know. But we can redo some things. Oh. Our viewers on our YouTube channel have not seen that recipe. Oh. Okay. And it is a good one. Um, it is delicious. It is very, very delicious. So, we have the pecans in there. Oh, stop laughing. Okay, this is the extra mini That's a Bowl. Now the That's a Bowls are on sale this month. You can actually get a set of three extra minis for $24. Or we have our huge stack of six bowls that all nest inside each other. That's on sale as well, which I'll talk about later. But anyways, do you wanna continue with our recipe, Mike? What do we have in here? Uh, Brussels sprouts. Yes, perfect. So we have about three cups of Brussels sprouts in here that we have like washed, cut up, halved. And he is going to put um, about a tablespoon of olive oil in here. Like doubling the recipe or tri tripling? Tripling. We're tripling the recipe just because that's how many Brussels sprouts I had and I figured it's just easier to do them all. And let's be honest, I like a little bit extra um, I like a little bit extra sweetness, so um, it calls for maple syrup. So we're actually gonna do a little bit of extra maple syrup. Oh, we need a spatula. Okay, I'm just gonna turn the, er. You're gonna stir those. Yeah. Okay. And then put it back in. on the grill position for another two minutes. 
So we're putting olive oil in here, maple syrup, put an extra tablespoon of maple syrup, please. It is, was also maple syrup season. I didn't count, but I think I did put an extra one. Well, uh, like I said, I do like sweet, so. It's a little extra love in there. I don't think I'd call that love. No, it's love. And then um, hot sauce. So, and a little bit of salt and pepper. So here, you do the, I'll do the salt and pepper. And you do the, the hot sauce. We're but, doing this together. But not half a teaspoon? Yeah, you can do maybe a whole teaspoon. Don't triple it, just double it. We don't need as much hot. <laughs> yes, please use the correct teaspoon. And then literally, we're just gonna mix this up. Then we're gonna place it in the micro pro grill uh, in the casserole setting for four minutes. And then we'll mix it and then um, put it in the grill setting for four minutes. So just mix this up, get the maple syrup and the sriracha all over the Brussels sprouts. It's actually French red hot. Oh. Right, we used Frank's Red Hot. Put that stuff on everything. He does, I don't. <laughs> I prefer maple syrup on everything. And he prefers hot sauce. So, there you go. We've got our Brussels sprouts all nicely. And actually, oops, I, I'm making a mess now. We could also, because the that's a bowls have an airtight liquid tight seal, we could mix like this and not have to worry about it going everywhere. Now, Mike did take this out of the microwave using his fingers, which I don't recommend. This does get hot to touch. So uh, this isn't something you also wanna place on your stove or on your table, it does get hot. So we have toasted our, well, that's what we were doing. We were toasting our pecans and they smell a bit toasted. Yeah, they do. Okay, so then we are going to, ooh, can you hear that sizzle? That's because the grill, here, just let me do it. Hands off, I got this. Not very often I tell my hands off. Okay. Okay, so now this has, like I said, two positions. One's a grill, one's a casserole. So when you're doing dips and baking, you um, mainly use the casserole setting. So yeah, that's grill. So it has um, a little arrow with a, like a, the raised picture so that when you line those up, it's in the casserole position. And then when you turn it, it actually sits inside the micro pro grill and that's when you get that searing, crisping. Um, How long is this? Four minutes. So you're gonna do four minutes and then four minutes. We did make a little bit of a mess here. We got maple syrup everywhere. Uh, this is not a we thing, that's a you thing. <sighs> oh, is it? Yep. So the micro pro grill also comes with this cute little cookbook that I have now got maple syrup on. And um, it just explains how it works. It is non-stick, which is amazing. So nothing sticks to it. It's great for cleaning. However, it cannot be cleaned in the dishwasher. It is a hands-only uh, cleaning. The one thing I do like about it, it is kind of compact and portable. So we take it with us on vacation. Yeah, you did hear me say that. We take it on vacation. We have made pork chops, fajitas, sausages. sausages. Bacon, did we get bacon in it once too? Probably. Yeah, so we've used it on vacation and it is great. It takes a lot less time, great cleanup. So, uh, and in this little, it has a reference. So if you're cooking something, how long to cook for using this and the temperatures. And then it also has some great recipes. So uh, cheesy apple panini, uh, Italian turkey burger, Perfect 
personal pizza, so you can do pizzas in there too because it kind of crisps the bottom of them. And you do that in the casserole setting. And then blueberry crumble. I think we, mm. we have made that. Yeah, we've made the blueberry crumble. That is really good as well. So uh, it's a great little product. Might be going on sale soon. Maybe. Anyways. Is that a hint? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> yes, dear, it was a hint. Oh. Uh, measuring cups. We didn't use the measuring cups tonight, but we did use the spoons. Those are on sale right now. Love them. You get five with or six with each. So you get like all the measurements. The numbers are never coming off because they're like lasered in there. <clears throat> oh, and look at that. Mike's laying them all out for you so that you can see all the multitudes and they don't tip over. So technically, uh, right now there's a little bit of maple syrup left in the tablespoon and it's not pouring out, leaking everywhere because it doesn't tip over. And they all snap together, which is great. So they're on sale in this really nice pink color right now, which is perfect for Mother's Day. Right here, pink. They are $24, regularly $37, so not a bad deal. Oh, and then those, um, mini that's a bowls that I was met mentioning and the whole entire set can you see that it's hard sometimes to see there we go that whole six piece set is on sale for $99 which is a super good price so um, that's something that uh, is a great deal for mom as well because Mother's Day is coming up and you still have time to order so um I think that's all for this episode, Lona. Yeah, I think that's all for this episode of Monday Night Munchies with Mike. We will back. We'll be back next week with another pecan, pecan recipe for you. Something a little, another little twist on a pecan recipe. Something you may not think of that you should do with pecans. So, see this finished product. Oh, yum. So they're nicely grilled. This is a great side for any meal. There you have it. Sweet and spicy Brussels sprouts. Enjoy.